You just have to go where the story takes you, even if it scares you. And for me, that's most of the time. Like, I'm frightened out of my mind by the things I write. Uh, but I'm getting it out of my system, so it feels good. Um, and that, that in mind, I'd like to read a passage from my latest story, The, uh, the Atomic Stigmata of Dr. Ignatius. Yeah. And then I'll start here. In the morning, she pours space whiskey on my chest and licks it off. The Astro Bank had foreclosed on the motel we were running in Southern Andromeda. She knew I would be going back to my job as a chiropractor. And my wife, Susan KL4000. She collapsed in my shiny metallic arms, and we fell down onto the disheveled bed and curled together like two pulsing electric snails. <laughs> two human crustaceans <laughs> in our shells of lies. <laughs> Searching for warmth and certainty under the rock of a dying love affair. Thank you, I'm burning.